Hi everyone, it's Marsha and I'm back with your Market Minute for Waterloo Region. I'm getting fancy now, guys. I have a microphone now. I'm so excited. Okay, so currently we have 1,314 active listings in our MLS. This is an increase of 194 from my last update, which was two weeks ago. In the last seven days, 399 new listings came to market, an increase of 45. We saw 184 properties sell and an additional 64 sold with conditions. Uh, we saw 82 properties decrease their price and 27 increase their price. All right, so inventory is increasing week after week. And the ratios of homes that are selling below and above asking are actually staying consistent. So we are still at about 55% of homes that um, sold above asking, 37 sold below asking in the last seven days. And we had 7% sell at the asking price, okay? So the number of homes um, that decreased their price actually increased dramatically and increased by 32 compared to two weeks ago. But at the same time, that's not surprising um, considering we have that much more inventory. And what that means with those price fluctuations, um, when you see a, a property um, increase their price or decrease their price, it typically means that whatever strategy was in place um, didn't work. So perhaps they were holding offers for a week, hoping to get multiple offers. Um, perhaps they listed it at market value, hoping for a quick sale. Um, those are just a couple of examples. But what that means is that the whatever strategy was in place didn't work. So now they're they're adjusting their pricing to try and attract those buyers to get the end result that they're hoping for. If you have any questions about that, let me know. I know it's number one question I get is how to price a home. Buyers have more choice uh, with the increase in inventory. So what that means is that it is even more crucial now than ever for a home to be priced right the first time and the preparation to be there before getting to market. Buyers will not pay top dollar for a property that is overpriced, dirty, cluttered, and or in disrepair. So really important that that preparation is there and the pricing matches the condition of the home. All right, because proper pricing is what attracts buyers first and foremost. All right, so for buyers out there, it is the ideal time, it's a very smart time actually to be purchasing a home right now, whether it's your first home or you're looking at investing in real estate, um, because prices are down about 20, 25% compared to they were during the pandemic boom. So this is the ideal time if you can afford it, because as interest rates will go down eventually, they may go up a little bit more, nobody has that crystal ball, but eventually they, they will come down. And that means that house prices will go up as more buyers are going to be able to afford to get in a home. So this is the ideal time because the sooner you buy, the more equity you're going to have, more equity gains that you'll have when that does happen. All right. Okay. Um, yeah. So if you have any questions, let me know. You know me. I can talk real estate all day, every day, and twice on Sunday. So reach out anytime um, if you would like some more clarity on what all of this means for you and your real estate plans. Happy to help. Okay, have a great day and thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one.